Good day guys and welcome to my YouTube channel. In our previous class we talked about how to make a list function using the sum in an Excel. Now today we are moving on to another database function in Excel which is called the average. So it is the same method applied here except that we are going to choose the average option and not the sub function the sum option so now let's get started let me create my categories as well as i want to make my categories i want to make a condition here rather so now how i'm going to use average expenses because i'm going to, I want to, I want to look for average here not the total expenses now i'll be able to create a condition now right now a condition has been created now so now i want to create a condition let me make use of supply as well let me create make use of a supply so i want to make a condition also here too so i want a condition whereby i want to get i want to i want a category that is equal to supply which that will give me an average expenses so under my category so my category is i want to i want my category to under supplies to, to give me an average average expenses in respect of supplies how are we going to do, go about that so the first step is to click on the word the cell in front of the supplier then go to your formula tab then go to your function uh, in, in search function then type the average function here yeah. yeah. right so you can see so you click on ok so automatically it brings the 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 average function uh, function in an excel here so now what is my database here so now here i'm looking and uh, my database here is what so you have to pick my database from here to down i want to i have to select the whole list on the on the spreadsheet here so now i'll be able to pick from a one you can see from a one down towards down to a 59 so in the feed now the feed i want i want the total expenses here the average total expenses here so that will be my feed so the, i need the average here, so we should represent my total expenses so in the criteria feed here so my criteria is that I want to tell the category that will equal what supply that will give me an average expenses right click on OK you see so here in this figure the supplies the category that will automatically give me what the average expenses is the average expenses in respect of what categories under supply is what well, six 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 thousand three one eight point seven five can see just work it out it's very simple so and don't forget to subscribe to my youtube channel i keep up giving you the updated and dynamic excel links functions bye